So the good people at Sontronics have sent me the Elevate Boom Stand to test out and review for you guys, so that's what I'm going to do. Now if you're a podcaster or vlogger, you're probably more than likely going to need a boom mic stand to incorporate into your setup. Now I have done videos before with cheaper boom arms, which are fine, they do the job, but they're a bit squeaky, they're spring loaded, they often don't look that slick. You can see with this Sontronics Elevate the difference in quality. This is a premium product. It's a really nice matte finish, really well built, robust. The base itself, got a thick base, even the attachment to your desk. Now this is what you get with the Sontronics Elevate. You can see the size of it compared to the ones that you usually get. I can say these work fine with the smaller, cheaper boom stands. Obviously with something a little bit bigger, you're gonna need a weightier, bigger desk mount, which you get with the Sontronics boom arm. So this comes with the Sontronics Elevate. As you can see, it opens really wide. You can attach it to pretty much any desk that you wanted to do so. Now also in the box, you get this long screw. So if you wanted to permanently attach this to your desk, there is a way of doing that. It's quite straightforward. You basically eliminate this part of the clamp and you're just gonna attach this straight onto your desk. So if you want something that you can permanently mount to your desk, then you can certainly do that with the Elevate. So in terms of size, it's about a meter long, 949 millimeters to be precise from top to bottom. So as you can see, it's a fairly long boom arm. If you compare it to the cheaper one that I showed you before, then obviously that's a much shorter boom arm and that's quite standard for the less expensive boom arms. But with this one, it's about a meter. Let's have a look at some of the things that set the Elevate apart from the cheaper boom arms. So there are no springs, so you're not gonna get any nasty spring noises. We have three different plastic knobs, so you can adjust your Elevate to whichever position you want the mic to be in, okay? And these just twist and tighten and they do stay in position nicely. You can actually adjust the resistance on the bottom one. There's a little screw underneath where you can just adjust the resistance so it's not as stiff. But I think you want a little bit of resistance with the bottom one especially. Okay, so you can adjust it into all different shapes and sizes for whichever space you have. So as you can see, it's a nice size and you're not gonna get any creaky noises from any springs. Like I said before, it's a really well built matte finish, so it looks smart. And what's really good about this one is, as you can see, these bits here are to hide your mic cables. So you run the mic cable along the middle and then it fits into these little grooves and then you just pop these clips over the top and that will keep your cable in place and out of sight, so it keeps it nice and tidy, makes it look professional. So when you're going for the more premium boom arms, that's what you're looking for. You want your podcast to look professional, you want everything to look slick. This one's got a nice Sontronics logo down the bottom, and it's got Sontronics logo on the arm as well. So really nice, smooth, like I say, matte finish. So this Elevate arm actually goes perfect with the Sontronics Podcast Pro, their flagship podcast mic. Now I will be doing a review on this in another video very soon. Uh, you will be able to find it here but at the moment if you're watching this video as it comes out that video hasn't been made yet but I will be making it very soon and you can see how this arm goes with the podcast pro which looks like an awesome little podcast mic. And this just attaches into the clamp and it's easy to move around. Easy to install, easy to move around. Okay, the other end, it's got your standard mic clip mount. If you've already got one of these inside your mic clip, if you haven't, then this just attaches to the end. And this comes with the arm, so you're covered no matter what sort of mic clip you are using. So the stand itself is actually quite light. It's 844 grams, so it's well built, but it's not heavy. It's a nice lightweight design. So price-wise, 
the Elevate comes in around 95 pounds, which is probably similar in US dollars, which for this product, I think is a really good value. If you're gonna permanently fix this to your desk or you're planning to use this regularly in your setup, looks professional. If you're doing a podcast, you can get two or three of these with a nice podcast mic and it's not gonna break the bank but it's still gonna look pro. So 95 pounds for what you get, I think is a really good price. I love the clamp, it's proper bulky, it's got a pad on it, so it's not gonna scratch the top of your desk and it's not going anywhere when you've got that on your desk. And just the design of it, I just think it looks really slick. I love the way that you can hide the mic cable by using these little clips. I just love it, so I'm definitely looking forward to using it for some of my vlogs. So that's it for the review. Thanks to the good people at Sontronics for sending me the Elevate. Really enjoyed reviewing it. I'm really going to enjoy getting some use out of it. And I can't wait to review the Podcast Pro. If you have enjoyed this review and found it useful, please do leave it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Let me know if you've used the Elevate or if it's something that you think you might consider using. If you haven't already, please do consider subscribing to my channel. I'm releasing content on a Monday and Thursday at the moment. Audio and visual gear tech reviews, editing tutorials, drone tutorials. I've got a new After Effects course that I've just started. So all sorts of things going on. It'd be great to have some new faces on board. If you're already subscribed, appreciate you guys as always. And make sure that your notifications are turned on so I can let you know when new content is released. That's it for this one. I'm going to get this Elevate set up ready for my next vlog and I'll catch you in that one.